How's it going out there, everybody? As always, I am the Wolf Knight, and welcome back to some more Dragon Quest Builders. Continuing with where we last left off, I want to say, uh, kind of had a little snafu with the past two episodes. Now, what happened was, I had said, I had, rec I was sitting here, you know, doing my thing, recording the episodes, talking, the whole time. Now, the unique feature about my, my, my new mic that I got, uh, for Christmas, is that it has a uh, switch down here. It has, an ev it has a volume adjuster and a switch that allows me, you know, to increase, you know, the sound I hear. If things get if things get too loud, I can soften it up. If things get too soft, I can raise the volume so I can hear stuff better. It also has the switch to turn the mic off and on, so where uh, my voice isn't being, you know, used. So like if I'm talk if I have like a party set up on the like I'm just sitting there talking to my friends and we're playing a game. If I have the flip if I have the switch flipped down, then you won't hear my friends wouldn't be able to hear me. The same feature also applies to apparently when I'm recording videos. And that's kind of what happened with my uh, last two episodes. I had forgot that I had my mic switched off. So my voice didn't get recorded for the whole two episodes, so we're going to go over, you know, what we did in those, like, well, at least what I can remember. We had one of the guys wanted us to build this scenic shower room, and I can't remember what else. I think we did, fi I think we finished off the silver bar, as you can see. We got that all tucked away. And I think we did some decorating. I can't necessarily remember because it was a f it was like a few days ago. So, what are we doing today? Well, we got a mission over here for one of these guys. Let's go talk to him and see what he wants. Looks like he wants us to uh, do the party. Ah, yes, he wants us to do the party at the silver bar. We're just sitting here standing in the water. And they're gonna dance. <laughs> Her outfit really changed, didn't it? <laughs> A little dance. Why are they all standing up on the platform and, you know... Uh, we're just, you know... Why are they standing on a roof? <laughs> Why is everyone not like grouped together in one little spot enjoying the show? They're standing up on a platform. We're here just standing in water and they're over there just standing chilling on a roof. So we got some people to talk to. Let's go talk to Goldorex first. Now that's I think that's one of the other things I can't remember if we got him to gold the gold golem, but uh, yeah we managed to get him to the gold golem as well. Shine strange, more shiny than me. <laughs> Want to marry Babs? <laughs> you build church for me and Babs, we marry. Well, <laughs> he's certainly hopeful, isn't he? Let's go talk to him, see what he wants. Party's in full swing now, yes. And they're up there still just dancing away. So, let's talk to him. I think they want us to basically dance too. <laughs> Everyone's just getting in on the fun. Uh oh. Could this be the big boss? Such sounds, such sights. I'm guessing this would be Medusa. Like I already don't know that it is. Hmm, what is Medusa known for? Yes, turning people to stone. Hmm. 
<laughs> now she's uh, just a, basically a big old statue. It's like, who could have guessed that the monster Medusa would have been able to turn somebody to stone? The next morning, everyone's all sad. Why did everyone just fall out of the sky? Well, this is another thing about removing the platform, you know, when when we first came here to crumble them, you remember that there was a, like a little dirt thing here. This is one of the things you can have a problem with. You know, her just being stuck here in midair. So let's talk to, to Goldorich. Me feel bad. Want to defeat Medusa. Full strength returns. Maybe he can lift curse. Our shining light has disappeared and dealing, daily digging and will surely follow suit. It's like we're back to square one. Josh U. Willer must build special thing. Bring Medusa to surface. Hey, it's anything da bright and building a beautiful building. Of course it would. You could probably guess. It's like, hmm, we have a copper bar. Over there we have the silver bar. Hmm, I wonder. What could be next? As if I haven't already told you. <laughs> so Malroth calls in the two miners. Oh, um, I wonder where they're going to go. Malroth really has a way of uh, inspiring people, doesn't he? Hey! Get off your sorry butts and let's go do something. And then as you see, we've already got the area nice and prepped. Now I don't think they should knock out our little decorations we've done. Yep. Uh, decoration is safe. There, that gives us plenty of space for the new building. Now it's my turn. And we're basically getting to the end game of this chapter. We will construct. <laughs> Gold bar, level one blueprint. So like once again from chapter one, our townspeople will get to building this for us. But they'll be like the other one, there'll be certain key ingredients that we must go and grab for it to be finished. Are they, are they? Are these muscle heads basically able to appreciate such a glorious bar? I think they are. Everyone's getting all excited to uh, build the bar. So is Goldrix. Going for the gold. Build the gold bar. We just finished turning Goldrex into solid gold. If the, this Medusa hates shiny things so much, why did she turn Babs to stone and not him? It's because she's the most shiniest thing in the. She's the bright and shining star of this whole place. That's why. She's a light in everyone's life here. So, would you be more interested in turning a big hunk of, you know, valuable metal or the light of everyone's life? into stone if you're a monster. Hmm, the choices. We all save Babs together, build gold bar together. Let the mission begin. Now let's go talk to our little blacksmith. It's high time we got stuck into building your blueprint for the gold bar. Back on Furrow Fields, when we built the day tree, three stages, maybe Josh still figured out what the final building is look like. So yes, at the end of each chapter, we will basically build the main structure in three stages. That's how it goes for each town when you arrive. 
gather the resources, build the buildings that they suggest in whatever way you can. Can you show us how to build the bar? So what it'll basically do, so like back on furrow fields when we started building the day tree, you just have to come over here and we have to face, place down like the first 10 blocks if I remember correctly. So let's make uh, just some one set of gold bricks should do. Pound that out. Come up here. Uh, let's see, this is the entrance right here. Let's take a look at it. So it's one, two, three, four, five, six wide. So I think this will be acceptable. Go up to the gold bricks. And it looks like we can place one there. There. Oh, not there. Whoops, nope. Didn't mean to do that. No, I don't think they went there. So. Do we need to put more? Guess we need to put a little more. I assumed it would be tin bricks, so let's make another. You know what? We'll make at least another 20. This should be more than enough. So we don't have to place down many for them to start building the bar itself. Come on, guys. I've placed down 30 bricks. Are you still not satisfied with building this? First, co sign the blue. First gold brick blocks once you got 50 down. Okay. We got down 40 exactly. How is it that we were just 10 bricks short? Hmm. So remember this. When you go to build the gold bar, it's 50 bricks. You need 50. 50, 50, 50. Place the first 50 blocks on the blueprint and inspired the town folks. How are you getting on? Looks like you're making decent progress. I wouldn't really call this a little bit uh, decent progress. Look what we found. Bang back a bunch of materials for building the gold bar. Now plop the chest down right over there. Plunk. That's got all the materials they need to build this whole thing. The great th and that's the great thing about it, we don't have to build anything. They all just make the necessary materials. So, so now let's see. What do you want? Mission complete. It's basically thanking us for fixing the, uh, set this up. No problem. Everyone's getting pumped. Now we're off basically wondering why they're all getting pumped to do this. Now go my minions! Build! Build I say! Is there anyone who is not building? Are all my minions working? Yes they are! And look! Oh, I just love this part. <laughs> just watching the whole bit, just watching the building blueprint go down. Now, later in the later in the game, you'll get the ability to make your like get this called. Ed, I think it was like Builder Islands. And when you go to one of those, you can basically when you make your own blueprint, get the ability to make your own blueprints. 
All you gotta do is have the materials in a chest. And the villagers, whatever villagers you have on your builder island, will do this exact thing. They will basically construct the blueprint for you. Because I, ju I just love this. It's just like... It's like, ah... It's like, uh, building automated. Who doesn't like it? <laughs> and because there's like so many working on this, it just goes up so fast. It's like we're only about halfway through the day and... Still got plenty of resources in here. I mean, look at how many gold bricks are in here. Gold tiles, carpets, windows, just... All the different knickknacks. We'll have to work on, uh... I think when it comes to off-camera... I think after we finish with this episode off-camera, I'm gonna take this section right here. Like, this whole, like, section of stairs and... Oop, didn't mean to pick that up right yet. And we'll just move it over one so it's like in line with this entrance. So everything's all nice and symmetrical. See, this is 87. In this, in this small amount of time. In about what? Like a two, three minutes? They've almost completely built this bar. We're 91% done. It's just glorious. <laughs> I just love watching this because it's just so cool. I think this is, you know... The best feature in this whole game. They don't have it. Uh, now I do have the first game. I got this one before I got the first one. Because this, at, the, at the time, this is the game I saw. This is the game I wanted. And then uh, you know, when I got to the when I got to the part where they started building the day tree the first time, I was like, like I was just impressed with it, and I was like, oh, this is so cool. And I love that they did all the work and it said I completed the blueprint. <laughs> it's like, yes, I worked extremely hard to construct this. I didn't even, well, I barely lifted a finger. I placed down like 50 blocks. Light boxes, you say, but you need them to be red. Or there's a little oasis nearby where you can find red dye. Maybe that's just the thing you're looking for. Now, I believe we've already been there. Yeah. Now, let's go uh, check our chest. I believe we sh I believe we already have the red dye. I can't remember. A dye. Uh, no, we don't. So we go to our map. And we have been over there, we just didn't collect the red dye. So let's warp back over there. And it's very easy to find. It's, it's just like, as you can see, it's just right there. I know, Malroth, I don't want to talk to you while we're underwater. I want to collect all this red dye. So what we're going to do... Is do a little power smash. That'll easily allow us to collect what we need. Let's see if we can uh, jump out of the water because it'll at least allow us to mine faster. Let me out of this water. Thank you. Sorry about that, guys. My mom needing a hand with something, apparently. Now, I'd like to collect all the red dye that we have, you know, just plenty of coloring options. You don't have to, but, you know, like I said, I like to. Alrighty, that's all the red dye we need. But we're basically out of time for this episode. We're winding down the last few seconds, so... 
Hope you all guys enjoyed it. Please be sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you all. Hey, look. The big old guy over there. And I'll see you all next time. Goodbye.